Let's take a look at how to find the atomic number for gold. That's AU on the periodic table. So if we look at the block here from the periodic table for gold, gold is right here on the periodic table. If we look at this, the atomic number, that's going to be the whole number, and it's almost always above the element symbol AU. So gold, the atomic number is 79. The atomic number, that's equal to the number of protons. So gold, its atomic number is 79, and it has 79 protons. In fact, the atomic number, sometimes it's called the proton number, because it's the number of protons in the nucleus of the atom. If we look at the periodic table, this number here, this is the average atomic mass. If you need help with that, there's a link in the description and at the end of this video. But the atomic number, if you have trouble remembering which one of these numbers is the atomic number, First off, we'll always have a whole number. And second, as you go across the periodic table, it increases by 1, 78. And here's gold, 79. Only gold has an atomic number of 79. So as you go across a row in the periodic table, it's going to increase by 1 each time. That helps you remember which one of these is the atomic number. One last thing. All the elements on the periodic table are neutral. They don't have a negative or a positive sign after them. Since they're neutral, the number of protons, that's going to also equal the number of electrons. That's why they're neutral. So if we have atomic number of 79, we have 79 protons. We'll also have 79 electrons. This is Dr. B discussing the atomic number for gold, AU. Thanks for watching.